what's going on you guys it's me again Vince with another video and today I'm right behind my truck but I'm gonna go ahead and install an awning um, from a company called Overland Vehicle System it's pretty much the same company where I got my roof depth tent so I want I want everything to be uniform you know so let's just go ahead and dive right into it and I'll show you how it's done so here's the awning that I got from Overland Vehicle Systems so it's going to be coming in a box like this uh, this is the 2.0-6.5 awning that they have they have different kind of awnings on their um, website and you, I'm gonna put their link down below you might want to go ahead and check them out they have some cool variety of different kind of awnings so right out of the box this is what you guys are gonna be getting um, the awning is pre-installed already uh, so you're gonna have two brackets two sticks and this heavy-duty uh, ropes and some of your hardwares so since my rooftop tent opens towards the driver's side I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on the driver's side as well so that we're gonna have like uh, one big um, shade here whenever I open the tent so it's just gonna be awning here and a rooftop tent over there so we have a big shade right there so for this install I'm gonna be using the last load bar of my Prince rack and the first load bar in the front so I'm just gonna go ahead and slide a carriage bolt here and then just put the bracket on it So I'm just going to be locking them with the regular washer here. And for the last one, I'm going to be using this uh, washer, I mean this nut with the ring. And I'm going to explain to you later why. So for the main awning itself, um, it's going to have two channels here. So what you're going to do is just insert your, um, your bolt in here and just slide it all the way to where the brackets are. Um, it's pretty easy. So just line them up and then all you have to do is just put the nut and it should be good to go. Alright guys, as you can see all of the bolts are mounted already. And if you notice, I actually used this looped uh, nut here. The reason why I did that is um, because I wanted to use this padlock to lock it in position. So what you're going to do is just like that. There you go. It's in position and it's not going anywhere. <laughs> 